Hi hey guys, and welcome to Ryosei's Route. Hope you guys enjoyed Kiyosuke's Route last time, because that was kind of difficult for me. This time, we're going to start out with Kiyosuke's Route, Mission 9. Stay on this bearing. Are we still on course for Hachikiko Island? Yes, sir. We'll be arriving shortly. Any sign of enemy movement? No, sir. Not within a 100 kilometers radius. Good. Strange. I was expecting chasers from Kyoshu. Let's try out the Higane submergence function. Diving, sir? Yes, it has it. In the Izu Osogara Strait, with a depth of 3,000. The DC's sub maximum depth is only around 2,000. But since the Higane is a spaceship, it can dive deeper. Unless they use the DSR, they've never reached us. Check the watertight compartment to, to prepare to dive. I haven't seen Kusha since we launched. How am I going to get her off this ship? What? We're on the water! Didn't you hear the announcement? What announcement? Were you listening to music again? Nah, this is what I call a ship, ya? Yeah? Ryuse! Don't try to change the subject. What's up, Ryuse? Feeling down? No, I'm fine. You don't look fine, man! Come on! Maybe I can help. If it's about a girl, he won't be able to help. He only knows a bunch of cheesy pickup lines. You don't think these uh cheesy last night? <laughs> Chris is doing weird things again in his jokes. Here's the medicine from Dr. Kashibashi. Thank you. By the way, Kushu, did my father say anything? No. I see. Oh, were you say? I gotta go to the hangar. Hmm. What's wrong with him? I don't know. Hey, is that why? We're passing latitude 30 knots. Our current depth is 3,000. Any signs of the enemy? We haven't picked up anything on radar. As we suspected, the DC subs can't reach this depth. Latitude 30 knots is the depth, deepest area in the, of the Uzu Strait. Oh, really? It's almost 10,000 meters deep. Not even the Hagane can survive it. Enough, we're in Battle Station 3. So, sorry, sir. This may be a safe water. Don't let your guard down. Sonar contact! This is our tor This is a torpedo! What? A torpedo? At this death? Make that six torpedoes! Bearing 287! Battle Station 1! Full speed ahead! Rig for battle! Full speed ahead! Rig for battle! Aye! Did you hear something? Uh... Apparently I'm talking too loud. I'll quiet down a bit. Take an evasive maneuver. Load tubes 1 through 4. With 18 torpedoes. Aye. 45 degrees. Starboard. Load tubes 1 through 4. Open the vent. Torpedoes 1,800 meters. In closing. Fire. Tubes 1 through 4. 1 through 4. Fire. 5 down. 1 to go. Here it comes. Face of action. We're not going to make it. Oh, it hurt. Episode five, 9, Silent Service. Report the damage. The torpedo hit the starboard aft. The Tesla drive is down. What? Aft block 8 and 11 are taking water. What? We're sinking because the Tesla drive's not working. Use the trim tank to keep us at this depth. R Roger. Sonar's detecting something in front of us. And there's subs. Data match, they're DC subs. We've been ambushed. I didn't expect their subs to reach this depth. We can't launch our PTs at this depth either. We'll sink if anything happens to the Gane. Alans, keep the disc depth and get us out of here. Are we going to fight them, Captain? Our destination is Adios Island. We can't receive supplies, so we must avoid combat. I see. Then shall we move to this, gr to this grid, sir? Um, oh boy. Yes, full speed ahead. All enemies shot down. Oh boy. This is just a ship, huh? All hands prepared for the submarine warfare. Bow torpedo! How do you fire a missile underwater? Okay, so how many enemies do I have to take out? One, 
two, three, four, five. Okay, I gotta take out five subs. That's not that bad. Never mind that. Fire anti ship missiles! Ugh, the bow rudder is damaged, but it's still functional. Oh, yes, the Hagani is about to fire. Cannons, fire! Fire these laser beams underwater! How's that work, sir? I don't know. Just do it! Nonsense. You jump into that water, and, they'll, and the pressure will crush you in less than a second. Oh. Just let the captain and the EXO handle it. What? This little drive is malfunctioning. I can't control it. What? We're still sinking. The trim tank isn't helping. Darn it. Ignite the auxiliary rockets. Engine cluster. Surface. Keep us level. Y yes, sir. This isn't good. What's wrong? The gravity control isn't working because the Tesla drive is down. So we're being pulled to the bottom of the ocean. Are you serious? Yes, we're man maintaining our depth with the auxiliary engine. And the trim tank. But we can only do that for so long before we sink. Oh, no. E Ada, how much longer do we maintain our depth? Four minutes. Oh, God, no. That's it. We'll use the overboost to surface secure an area to low accelerate. Overboost? We only use that for taking off into space. This is an emergency, XO. Listen, with the time remaining... Oh, God, this is going to be very bad. Get us this grid sector. Aye, aye, sir. Uh, please tell me you have some abilities. I want to get this skill point. Appears so, sir. Perhaps they want to capture us. Stay alert. I wonder if this is going to work. I think I got this. Gun. Come on, make this work. Come on, work, work, work. We're going down. No. One guy left. Repeat a one or two five. Fire at will. Uh, we can't take any direct it. Another direct it. Port side sub. Gun. Take out the target. Enemy 40 degrees port side gun. No. Yes. At least I get the mastery. Yay. All enemies confirmed down. Good. Move to the target grid and use the overboost to surface. Whew. Servicing complete. No signs of hostility. We made it! Thanks to the captain's idea of employing the overboost, which is normally used for orbital launch, while we were still underwater. Don't forget, we used to be the, he used to be the captain of the Hiryu. He knows a thing or two about evasive maneuvers. Indeed. Exo, take us to South Bird Islands. Show, slow ahead. Repair the Tesla drive along the way. 
Aye, aye, sir. Looks like the Hagane is out of the water now. Hey, hey, Garnet, what did you want to ask me? Um, is it true that you and Yuyuru say are childhood friends? Yes. Are you, and you like him, right? Uh, no, it's not like that. What is like then? Well, Ryusei doesn't seem to be interested in me. You mean because of all he cares about are robots? Yeah, I have a hard time talking to him nowadays. I see. You just need to find the right time. Um, I guess, but... Okay then, I'm on it. Huh? What are you going to do? Don't worry about it. Just let me handle it. Dr. Hayamura, I finished checking the Hukiabian 009. Thanks. What's this? This was my mech when I was on the PTX team, led by Major Ingram. Wasn't the PT Special Forces unit before SRX? Yes, it's disbanded now, though. By the way, how is the 009? It's better, but it's still not as good as the 008L. Of course not. It's got a different power source. I know. I'll just use this guide in the next battle. Okay. What do you mean by a different power source, Rob? Oh, you don't know? There were three hooky bins. The 008L, the WR8R, and, the and this, 009. Which has a different power source? You mean 008 doesn't have the normal engine? Right. 008L and 008R were the first PTs to employ EOT. They're both equipped with black hole engines. This does not sound good! That is, like, what mech will have a mini black hole within it? That sounds horrible! It's like making an antimatter engine. Black hole engines, those sound dangerous. I agree! It was. The black hole engine is the in the 008R went berserk and blew up the base. The only survivors were Dr. Hanel and Rai. Rai? Yes, he was the test pilot. Oh. Rai lost his left hand in the accident. His left? The Hucubin was given the nickname Berserk Trooper. He didn't tell you about it? No. No. Same old Rai. Anyways, the alien technology was just too much for us. I can't believe Rai never said anything. Got the 0089! <laughs> and that was absurdly short. Well, guys, I just saved, and I hope to catch you next time and reuse this route. But that was really short. I expected it to be longer. Oh, well. Not the time, Chris. Anyway, catch you all next time. Toodles!